What's up everybody, my name's Rob Simmons, welcome to my channel. As a request, I'm going to react to The Warning before their original song, Enter Sandman, live at the Tetro Metropolitan CDMX in August of 2022. I hope I pronounced that correctly, if not, I apologize. I know some of you might be thinking, Rob, didn't you just do this song? Well, kind of, that was their music video featuring Alicia Cara, and this is going to be different because, well, obviously it's live in two. Alicia is not here. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe or notification bell because I publish new videos almost every day and I take requests from subscribers. All that being said, knowing the warning, I have a feeling this is going to be spectacular. So let's get to it. The crowd goes wild. Here we go. Oh yeah, no lip syncing here. Nothing but pure unfiltered talent. Aw, oh, beautiful harmony. This is good, good advice, playing a great workout. <laughs> Oh yeah. Oh, I love it already. I don't know why the OS is so calm. I don't know why they're not dancing right now. They're going crazy. Yeah, a lullaby during a rock and roll concert. Now we've seen it all. Beautiful.
All right, now they're going crazy. Oh my gosh. I did say in my intro that I had a feeling we were in for something spectacular and I am not disappointed, in fact, the opposite. And I have to say, these three sisters and Alicia made a great team together, but they just proved that the three sisters are more than capable of on their own because that was just awesome. I, I have nothing but positive things to say about that performance. And when I was a, a lot younger, a preteen, I used to think that studio recordings were better than live performances, but now I know that the opposite is true. And this is a prime example of, of that because what we just witnessed on the stage was nothing but pure unfiltered talent. And that's something I always admire in an artist or a group. And I think this is the fifth or sixth song from this, this specific show I reacted to from them. And I think it's safe to assume that the whole show is nothing short of spectacular. And obviously I have a lot more to go. I actually have a list of artists I react to on a regular basis that I'm going to see live the first chance I get. Gabriel Henrique and Dimash Kudaibergen to name a few and now I'm going to add the warning to that list. But all that being said, as always, let me know in the comments what you think. Thank you for watching.